So it wasn't long after 75 until some other people came out with some polyphonic synthesizers. For example, Yamaha invested in this same sort of digital scanning technology and started coming out with synthesizers like the CS50, the CS60, and of course the CS80. Uh, still very primitive, uh, still you know limited voice count, uh, extremely complex as far as synthesis is concerned, but certainly more keyboard oriented. And then in 1978, as uh, I'm skipping ahead a little bit, as you undoubtedly know, uh, Dave Smith with Sequential Circuits came out with not only a synthesizer that had a digital keyboard scanning, which allowed the allocation of notes played, five notes, to five oscillators, but also had the digital components so that the patches could be saved. These efforts solidified what polyphony for a synthesizer was for people who are interested in synthesizers. And unfortunately, that decision was that in synthesizer polyphony, all of the oscillators are playing the same wave shape. All of the filters behave in the same way. All of the envelopes are controlled by a single control, etc. There was a homogenization that took place in the 70s of polyphony where it couldn't be an orchestral thing where each note was played by a different timbre at a different frequency or whatever it was much easier to have all of them playing the same sound like a choir of a particular instrument like a group of trumpets or a you know a group of clarinets or saxophones way easier than having individual sounds and then trying to, again, find a way to direct certain notes to certain timbres. Unfortunately, it meant that that homogenization sort of settled in. And all polyphonic synthesizers from that point into the 80s took that paradigm and, and later took that paradigm that when you play a polyphonic synthesizer, you are you're in a situation where the, there's one timbre and there's that's just it when you play all the notes you play it's that timbre at all those frequencies so this is the point where polyphony became that thing